weeks. So he can't get into classroom for six weeks. So he's got to be here on Saturday and Sunday to catch up what he couldn't do in the summer because it's being used by somebody else. Okay. So he's here to help. And he's getting, you know, put on his knees by assault rifles. Which neighbor was this that call? Is it better if I don't knock on their door and be like, honestly? So what's the name of the program that works uh, here before he gets in? The Pasadena Educational Foundation. They okay. run a... And I talk shit like that because she's white and she's going to go tell her white neighbors. Right, so I'm Chicano. Like, I'm not a fucking wet bag. Like, I have a mm -hmm. right to fucking talk. I, I can do what the fuck I want to do. My money is green like their money, right? My lady makes a lot of fucking money because I make good money, so I'm not worried about that shit. So what happens is she goes to fucking... I, I, you know what? She might be the one that fucking called herself. She's a nosy fucking punk, too. She's one of my parents. Shit. And just so I have it correct, you're Mr. Mar Martinez, correct? Ramirez. Mr. Ramirez, Mr. Ramirez. And can I have a contact number for you, sir? Uh, that's uh, Chief Press. Chief Press that's, right. that's, that's my boss. Good morning, boss. How are you? Sunday morning on the Harley, and uh, I told my wife, I said, I gotta change my clothes. I gotta change my clothes and make a, to make a different impression on the police officer. Hey, you be alright, bud? Hey, you be alright? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Lock up, dude. Yeah. Well, you don't need to talk to me, right? No, no, no. I got, my, I got my wife texting me about you. She like, poor. Eric, is it gonna be okay? Tom, I'm sorry. It's not your fault, man. You know? It's not your fault. How the fuck did my PTA president find out so fast? I, I, do, I, I jammed over here. I was so doing 95. Do I was doing 95 on the freeway. What do you call it? Uh, you know, when something happens in Pasadena, you might have that alert thing. Oh, 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 uh, next door, next door neighbor or something. something like I yeah. think it's the Citizen app. Yeah. Something. The Citizen app is the big one that's around right now. No, but, uh, I mean, from what, I, from what they told me, that like, you handled it, like, you know, well, man. Like, you handled it respectfully, well, and that's props to you, man, because... Well, that's what a lawyer gets called. Yeah. Well, that's, I mean, any time a cop comes, that's it. I don't even, I'm not going to argue. Like, shoot me. Yeah. All right, man. Yeah, so I'm going to go in there. All right, man. Hey, you sorry about that. Hey, brother. You got it, man. All right. I'll be here, bro. I'm going to have to tell Steve to wear his uniform. Dude, no have what. to. Hey, he's black. Have to. <laughs> this one, too. This one right here, too. 
the other neighbor. What? That one too. She's in the corner. Hey, you know, it's funny, man. Like one time, uh, uh, she lives in the corner on this side. So this one right here is the one I call, right? That's it. And then she lives in the corner, two houses down. When you make a left, on the left hand corner. And uh, one time, this woman put her hands on me. This one right here. She, um, she caught me on the corner and, and she's like, one of your parents almost killed me. She's fucking doing this. And I go, first of all, don't you ever fucking touch me again. Right? And secondly, go tell them, call the police. You know, and since that point on, you know, it's been a fucking problem. And like I told her, I said, I might be the only Mexican in your life that doesn't work for you, so watch how you talk to me. <laughs> you, don't, you don't talk to me that way. You gotta be careful, dude. But... And it's so funny, man. If they saw me away from work, they wouldn't fuck with me. I'll play those games very well. You know, how old are you? I'm 25. Yeah, when you get a little older, you care less. <laughs> Right, cause like right now you gotta navigate. You know, you, you have some career options, right? Like you, yeah. You gotta, you gotta be cautious, right? And, and you're still, you're still sitting low on a totem pole. Right? You gotta, you know, you gotta watch where you, like where you navigate, right? Like, like at this, at this age, I'm closer to dying than I am to living. Right? I'm gonna be dead in 10, fucking 12 years. How do I, I want to live like that? Fucking scared and like, sorry, fuck you. Oh, I'm so pissed right now. Dude. Did you make contact with the officer that was here earlier? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I've seen him before. He's come to me. He's come to me before. Yeah. The guard said he was the most aggressive one, the black guy, the big dude, the older dude. Yeah? Yeah. The two striper? Yeah, and he's nice. The night dog, and he's been nice. He comes, you know, the cops, they, they come with their, I thought it was a fucking sergeant, so so they come off with their, you know, command presence, and they gotta, they gotta, like, they gotta, um, Physically let you know they're in charge, right? They gotta, they gotta posture up. I get that. Um, but, he, but he's nice. He's always nice. But he said he was the fucking hardest on him. Damn. That sucks. That's, but I'll give you a character test, right? He's still working. How do we home? Okay. Yeah. I, I was just thinking about that. Fuck this school, fuck, fuck this neighborhood, right? I would have been home. I would have just went home right now. And then gone on stress leave for three weeks. Can't go to work, I feel scared. But he won't, right? Because he's a grinder. And he gets treated like that. All right, dude, I'm going to go get my bike. Right. I, need, I, need some, I need some wind therapy. <laughs> enjoy, enjoy your ride, sir. You got it, sir. Oh. Oh.